Hello there, very good afternoon to you. I hope you're having a lovely weekend. Some gorgeous conditions across the UK, as promised. And you can see those systems really starting to make tracks in across northwestern parts of the UK, bringing cloud, rain and strengthening winds by the end of the night. But the bulk of England and Wales seeing a continuation of those dry, settled and actually rather chilly conditions for some overnight. Through tomorrow, the best conditions, England and Wales, wet and windy, Scotland and Northern Ireland. That's it. See you later. Bye bye. Good afternoon. Plenty of fine weather across the UK for this afternoon on into this evening. In fact, sunshine and warmth and the trees are now bursting in to full leaf. They're also producing a lot of pollen, high tree pollen levels almost across the board for the UK this afternoon. Much milder to the northwest of the UK, but in comes the cloud, in comes the rain. The weather front's pushing into Northern Ireland and Western Scotland by the time we get to Monday dawn. And it's that trend for things to come in from the Atlantic towards the UK that we pick up for this week. We've been locked under high pressure for much of the last week. The high drifts away south eastwards for the coming days and we'll see weather systems advancing from the Atlantic. So a windier story across the board and for some, some quite heavy and persistent rain. And again for Friday, another weather front coming into Western Scotland to the south of the UK. High pressure is starting to try and build again. Fine end to the week, I think, for England, Wales and Northern Ireland. For eastern Scotland too, with some sunshine, but towards the west of Scotland, another wet day. So much so that uh, some parts of western Scotland could get some quite significant rainfall accumulations during the next five days or so. For example, Oban, you can see the colours brightening up there as we go along our scale. Could see close to 100 millimetres of rain this week before we're through. So for the week ahead, a more mobile story. Windier, wettest for western Scotland. Biggest question, whether that rain will go in the south on Wednesday. Good evening. Plenty of sunshine still to be had out there to enjoy the final few hours of this Sunday. The trees have been having a high old time this weekend with the sunshine and the warmth casting out vast amounts of pollen. High levels blanketing the UK really through this weekend. Good evening. Well, it's been a mostly dry and settled weekend. We did have a few showers around yesterday, particularly across parts of eastern England, but today it has been largely dry and settled. Many of us have seen views like this, blue sky and sunshine. We've seen the fair weather cloud that's been bubbling up through the day, but it's not really been thick enough to produce any outbreaks of rain. Now, things are going to change a bit through this coming week. A more unsettled picture. It's going to turn a bit windier, some wet weather around, particularly for the west of Scotland. Potentially, parts of England and Wales could see a bit of rain through the middle of the week, but there's still a bit of uncertainty by that stage. Now, if we take a look at the expected rainfall that's going to accumulate through the next five days or so, very little, if any, reaching the far southeast of England, but the wettest area will be the west of Scotland, where some places, the West Highland, could see more than 100 millimetres of rainfall. Hello there, very good evening to you. I hope you've had a really lovely weekend. It's been gorgeous across the UK through today. Hello there, good evening. Beautiful day today, glorious sunshine and hopefully more to come through tomorrow. In fact, it might even be the warmest day of the working week next week. Hello. The weather's been pretty quiet this weekend thanks to the close proximity of a big area of high pressure. Through Sunday, most of us enjoyed a lot of dry weather and some spells of warm sunshine. Beautiful views here in Pembrokeshire. The high pressure is now, though, beginning to drift its way eastwards.